Namaste, I'm Archana. A warm welcome to day 15 of this 30 days of yoga. Today's session is inspired again by the element water. We're going to be bringing our awareness and focus in strengthening and opening up our hip region. So we're going to be doing asanas that are going to stretch and strengthen, in turn helping enhance flexibility, build stability and strength. So let's begin the session by sitting in a comfortable seated position, keeping the back straight, chin parallel, palms come to rest on your thighs, take a deep breath in, just becoming aware of the room that you're in, bringing our shoulders towards your ears, rolling it back, drop it down, exhale, close your eyes, just move your neck side to side, whatever comes organically. Or if you feel like just move in circles, clockwise to anti-clockwise. Again, take a deep breath in through your nose. Completely exhale through your mouth, letting out a big sigh. Releasing any tightness, any tension in your body. One more breath in. Completely breathe out. Slowly open your eyes with a few blinks. Now bring your right hand on your right knee. Your left foot is holding your the other way. Your left hand is holding your right foot and then you're going to just sway side to side. As though you're rocking a child, you can always hold and move it or hold with one hand. Hindo Dalasana, you cradle pose, three, two and one. Now grab hold of your Right toes with your right hand and just stretch your leg forward to the side as far as it can go. Again, forward the other side. You can draw circles if you want to, just uh, do whatever comes organically. And then straighten it out, grab hold and try and bring it closer towards your belly. Two and one. Release. Now the other leg. Hold and just move side to side. Remember you're not sitting into your back. Try and keep your back straight. Three, two and one. Grab hold. Of your left toe with the left hand stretch the other side i don't know if you can hear there's some background music going on outside there are some bhajans so this is going to be our background music for today's class very important like the element water just going with the flow Stretch, grab hold, three, two, and one. Release. Bring both your knees together. Swing your legs to one side. Come onto your knees and palms. Fingers wide. Arch your back. Chin just gaze forward. Breathe out. Round your back. See that your knees are beneath your hips. And pushing your seat towards your heel. Again, arch. And round. Push your seat towards your heel. Last one. Forward arch. Breathe out round. Now press your toes. Knees come off. Widen your legs. If you can, drop your feet flat. If not, it's completely fine. Raise both your heels. Drop it down. 
once more raise your heels drop it down press your left toes into the mat right foot comes up and here bring it bring your knees in the direction of the ceiling you're not stretching your legs out yet and then from with your knees draw circles one two three clockwise three anti clockwise three two and one now step between your palms adjust your back leg inhale come all the way up wherever you need to adjust see that you're not reaching shoulders directly over your hip focus on opening your hips breathe in as you breathe out turn and look towards your right fingertips again inhale straighten as you exhale again bend bring your right forearm to rest on your thighs trying to press your oh, uh, center towards the mat reach your left hand up towards the ceiling and if this is comfortable you can always go down reach and stretch 3 2 see that your left outer edge is not raising up and one drop your hands on the inside walk your legs to the outside of your mat or towards the right side of your mat see if you can drop your knees here come on to your fingertips breathe in completely breathe out then inhale and exhale press your hands back press your toes into the mat send your hip in the direction of your heel so you don't have to go and sit here hip come directly over your knee stretch your right knee out breathe in as you breathe out you're letting your belly come further towards the mat two and one now press your back toe press your hands into the mat bend the knee come all the way up head chest take your right hand on the inside right and left comes in stretch and hold you're in an extended pyramid but leaning forward more diagonally to and one back again come back bend the knee step back shake your legs out 3 two and one now bend the other knee your left knee up towards the ceiling draw big circles one two and three clockwise three anti clockwise one nice opening two and three step between your palms Adjust your back leg. Inhale, come all the way up. Vira Badrasana. Look at your left fingertips. Inhale, exhale, straighten. Bend again. Rest your left hand on your left thigh. Reach up if you can. Stretch further. Three. Two, hold, and one. Hands come on the inside. Walk the left leg out. Breathe in and breathe out. You want? You can stay on your palms or come on to your fingertips. Stretch and hold. And one. Drop down. 
press your toes into the mat. Straighten, drop the feet down. Reach your hands diagonally in the direction where the wall meets the ceiling. You're going to get a good stretch all through the leg. See that your back leg is not slipping. Press into the earth. One more breath in. Completely breathe out. And one. Hands come back. Bend. Bend your right knee, straighten the left. Bend your left knee, straighten your right. Breathe in. And breathe out. Now again, raise both your heels up. Take your right leg, send it up towards the ceiling. Drop that right knee behind your right wrist. Try to bring the leg parallel to the long end of the mat. Open into your pigeon pose. Initially, our heel may come closer to the groin and that's completely fine. Sit tall. Breathe in. Breathe out. One more big breath in. Breathe out. Reach your hands forward. Drop it into chest, forehead in the direction of the mat. One more big breath in. Completely exhale. Our hips are a region where we store in a lot of emotion and tension. Doing these asanas that help release the hip can also help release tension and bring about emotional balance. Every time you breathe out, just let go of thoughts that don't serve you. Let go of feelings that don't serve you. One more deep breath in, just inhaling all the calm, all the peace. Completely exhale. Palms come back on the mat. You'll hear some cracked and pop sounds. That's fine as long as no sharp shooting pain. Release. Shake that leg out. Now the other side. Bend. Send that toe up towards the ceiling. Arms in line with your ears. Bring and rest it here. Breathe in. Completely breathe out. Inhale. As you exhale, you can go lower, stay higher. Completely up to you. Notice if one side feels different than the other. One more deep inhalation, full exhalation. And as you breathe out, it could be you're letting go of even a person that doesn't um, bring positivity into your life. Just let go of anything that doesn't serve you. Inhale, slowly come up. Press your toes. Shake the legs out. Cross at your ankle. Come to lie on your back. Hug your knees towards your chest. Just rock side to side. Point your toes away from you, towards you. Bring the soles of your feet towards the ceiling and see if you can grab the inside arches of your foot or your toes or ankle. Happy baby pose. Just rock side to side. 
breathe in. Completely breathe out. Bring the soles of your feet to touch. Pull it towards your belly. Feel a nice stretch in your groin. And one, release, cross at your ankle. With your left, grab your right foot, right, grab your left foot. Press. This should feel good. Release, the other side. Press and hold, just for a couple of breaths. Release your legs to either side. Hands come to rest on your belly. Close your eyes. Breathe in. Completely breathe out. And noticing the flow of air entering your nostrils all the way till your abdomen. Pressing your belly into your palms, palms in the direction, moving in the direction of the ceiling. Very slowly exhale through your mouth. Letting your body get heavy on the mat. Once again, inhale. Bring your awareness to the flow of your breath to your belly. Belly pushing into your palms, palms moving in the direction of the ceiling. And now, very slowly exhale through your mouth. One more breath in. This time, let out a big sigh. Letting out a big sigh is another way to signal your body to completely relax. You can do this, uh, which we naturally do too, when something is not going away. So being aware of why you do it and practice it every time you need to. Now bring both your legs together. Arms come to rest next to you. We're going to take a deep breath in and chant one round of home, noticing the vibrations spread all through our body. Bring your right hand onto the floor behind you. Bend your left knee. Turn over to the right side and slowly come up to sitting. Continue keeping your eyes closed. Remember to get up slowly. Thank you for doing this practice with me, spending your time with me. I would love to hear your feedback in the comments below. If you're new here, remember to subscribe to my channel. If you think this video was helpful to you, please share. Spread the word about this channel, about this journey and get more people to join you. Namaste.